To add carpet into the database, double click on the carpet folder to expand it. Double click on Indoor Carpet Folder. Click on New SKU Style button to pop out New Item Window. Select Carpet Row for Row Good as Item Type. Enter the style code of the carpet as its unique product code. Others are optional. Select Display Color. Click on OK. Now on Product Detail Spec to edit its properties. Observe that the layout type is already set to carpet and the unit is set to square yard. By default, carpet width is to set to 12 feet. Click on Width pull down list to select a different width or simply type in the width for the carpet. Estimating width is actual width used for the layout estimating. If needing to accommodate trimming on both sides of the row, put in a smaller width, for example, 11 foot 9 inches for 12 feet carpet. The program calculates the carpet usages with the estimating width. Row length of the carpet is set default to 150 feet. If it is left to zero, the program treats the row length as infinity at estimating. Maximum row cut length is maximum cut length of each row cut at cut planning stage that is shown on the cut sheet. When it is not set, maximum cut length is the row length. Normally, maximum cut length is useful so cuts are not too long and heavy as it is hard to carry to its job site. Cut margin is the trim margin to add to each cut or fill piece. Usually it is set to 3 inches and it is gets applied to width or length of both directions at layout estimating stage. It is shown on the cut sheet as well. Max T seams is the maximum number of fill pieces or T seams to be allowed in a room. If it is not set to zero, there will be no T seams used in a room, but T seams can always be added manually per room basis at a later stage. Pattern carpet can be set up by entering pattern sizes into horizontal repeat and vertical repeat fields. Horizontal repeat in the pattern size is the width direction and vertical repeat is a pattern size in the row length direction. Pattern drop is the shift of pattern in one direction either in width or length direction, but not both. Normally pattern drop can be ignored as it is not used in estimating rather than a visual display. Pattern carpet is shown with a pattern grid on room area where applied. Click on save the carpet is now added to the product list on the right panel.